Okay, today we will be discussing how to convert a PNG image into a vector format that you can use for CNC machining. So what I have here on the screen is an image I found off of Google. Um, it's just a black and white image I copied and pasted in here. You can just right click and paste images into vCarve. Um, so I want to make sure I have this image selected. So you want to double click it so you get these readers on the outside and you want to make sure there's a pink highlighted box around it so you know you have it selected. And then you can come over to the left side of the screen and click on this bird, which is a trace bitmap function. This actually is what converts these PNG images into uh, vector formats that you can use for CNC machining. So this is just a black and white image. So I'm going to use the settings black and white, have this on 50. And then we're going to go ahead and click preview on this. And what you're seeing is it's actually tracing the pixels around this image and creating vector lines that we can then use to create toolpaths for our machines to actually engrave this. Um, so let's click apply. And then you want to close down the trace bitmap. And now it leaves you with the PNG image, but also it leaves you with the sketches. So from this point forward, you want to go ahead and delete your PNG image. We don't need that anymore because we have all of the vector lines from it. So from here, we have a workable file that we can use for CNC machining or laser etching. So I'm going to go ahead and create a toolpath for this to show you what it looks like after it's engraved. Um, you can go ahead and click calculate. I have a 90 degree V bit doing the engravings on this work and i'm also using an eighth inch end mill to kind of rough out everything so that that saves a lot of time when you use those clearance tools on this uh, so let me go ahead and preview this toolpath so we can get a good view of what it looks like here so from that file i took off of google which was just a random photo we converted that png image into line formats to the engraving process.